at 5.30, a brand new marketplace of vendors officially opened in downtown Norfolk today, months after a major retailer left the city. And this time, the key to success may lie in the very people making it all happen. Philip Townsend takes us to Grampy Street for a look inside the MIC. It's been just over eight months since Urban Outfitters left this prime spot in the heart of downtown Norfolk. Today, the doors are back open. Inside, a similar vibe with eclectic items and creative corners, but this time stripped of corporate influence. I really wanted to make sure that everyone that was part of this, that this was their vision as well. Kara Alexander first had the idea when she was heading off to college in South Carolina. A retail shakeup of fashion, design, art, and people in a large, stylish space. Pretty much everything that I love in one building, an experiential marketplace, it's, it's like opening a lifestyle magazine. She calls it the MIC. Market interactive community. Locally sourced art, clothing, pet items, honey, just to name a few. Skincare, vendor Angel Adele has you covered there. I've always had an entrepreneurial spirit. During the pandemic, she started her own skin and self-care boutique with products she made herself. Products she's passionate about sharing. I've always had a spirit to help people too. The MIC is now her platform, a place where she and other small business owners can reach customers still craving that in-person experience. Elevated. There's a plethora of us, and we're scrambling for a space to be able to show what we, how we serve the world. And that was always at the core of Kara's dream, creating a space that's more than just shopping, taking ownership and handing it back to the community in a marketplace of the future. People are supporting people, which is honestly what we have been needing for a long time. For 13 News Now, I'm Philip Townsend.